Hello, this is an Astroneer video answering the question, how far away can an auto extractor pick up resources? So I built this setup to show how far away the auto extractor can pick up resources. What we have up here is an auto extractor which I can turn on that is registering this resin down here. If you get a look at this, you can see it's quite a bit taller than a large canister, but it's not a huge area from the base of the auto extractor to where it can pick up resources. Also, we have this side, which is also able to be turned on, which means it's detecting resources, and it is detecting this piece of resin right here. So as you can see, the the Side to side is not very big, but it does look like it goes pretty deep. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn on this auto extractor here and it's gonna pull up resources in this area and we'll see how that works. So now that the auto extractor has been running for a while, you can see that this, this piece of resin is gone and this piece of resin is gone and I can't turn on this auto extractor or that auto extractor, which means that with those pieces of resin gone, we are now not able to detect resin with the auto extractors, showing that that is the limit of their range. So now to answer the question, can the auto extractor detect resources above itself? So what I've done is I've come over to this resin deposit over here. I've dug, dug down and put an auto extractor under here. I've also blasted away pretty much everything else in the vicinity so that it can only detect what it, what's above it. And if you can see here, I can turn this on and it picks up resin. So it can see quite a bit above itself. So it's most likely the detection radius of the auto extractor is a sphere or perhaps an ovoid around this size. I also did a little testing to see if the detection radius was actually a sphere or some sort of ovoid. So what I did was I placed a auto extractor at the limit of detection to a piece of resin, then built a wall and flipped it sideways, and it didn't seem to change the detection radius at all. So it seems to detect just in far as far in every direction, but it's it seems to be based on where the thumper will act the auto extractor will actually impact the ground as the center point of the sphere of detection. So there you have it. While the radius of detection is reasonably big for large pockets of resources, you're going to need to move your auto extractor around and possibly you could dig down and stick the auto extractor in the middle of the resources so you're collecting the resources above it as well. That's the end of the video. If you like this video, please subscribe and thanks for watching.